Hey everybody, welcome back, Falcon, Timber, and Stones. Is it Timber and Stones? It's not really Timber and Stones, it's Timber and Stone. Either way, welcome back, guys. Um, another episode, another day of recording, so this is my first one of the day, so I'm a little bit rusty as I usually am when I come back into a batch recording. Let me introduce to you guys Nomoto, right over here. You see her? Yeah, you see her. <clears throat> Nomoto, I think she's a builder? She's a miner. Alrighty, miner Nomoto, there you go, welcome aboard. Um, no motel, if you're not okay with being a girl, let me know and I will, I guess, swap you out of the rotation. You have to wait around again, though, so you might as well just hang out with the girl, dude. It's fine. You don't really mind anyway. You know what? You're a cyborg killer type of dude. That's what you always tell me all the time in the comments, so no motel, welcome aboard. We also have Kelly. Kelly's going to be our engineer now, so welcome aboard, Kelly. And finally, we have Princess Moon, who's over here um, chopping down some trees right now for me, which is pretty good. I mean, not really something you would kind of um, expect a princess to do, but there you go. So the way, guys, welcome aboard. You guys are new people around here. Let's um really quickly take a look, make sure there's no enemies around here, make sure that past Falcon didn't screw over future Falcon by leaving some crazy wolves or goblins or spiders around that we should kind of be worried about. It doesn't seem like there is anything, excuse me. There is something. There's a there's a fucking archer over here. Past Falcon, what did you do to future Falcon? Alrighty, so we do have an enemy over here, and that's a problem. Because you start letting these guys gather. Around? What? Wait a minute. <clears throat> wait a wait a goddamn second right here. I thought we killed these guys last time. Weren't these the guys who set my shit on fire? It looks to me that way. Hey Cortana, what are you doing out here? You're you're a farmer when uh, okay, I, yeah, you're a farmer. It's been a while, man. That's all I could say. What Okay. I'm seriously can Gather resources. Oh, okay, you know what happened? Here we go. Uh, <laughs> we did take care of them. Gather resources. You know what happened? Since I just loaded the game and I haven't actually literally started it, their bodies are still um, up. They haven't dropped to the floor, right? Let's find out. Let's, um, I'm a little bit worried right now. I was kind of like, wait a minute. I don't want to deal with this right now. Yeah, they just dropped dead. Okay. Hooey! <laughs> um, crisis averted. I, didn't, I wasn't ready for a fight right now, man. It's been, it's been a while. All right, it's been a few days since I last recorded. Give me a break here. Uh, I need to get used to the controls again. <laughs> okay, so those goblins are dead. You know what that means? It means that Fatal Extraction needs to go over here and collect some bodies for me. Or not bodies, but, you know, loot these guys right here. So he's doing a wood chopper now. Let's get you back into foraging, my friend. And let's, let me jump over to you because um, I want you to just focus on gathering the the remains of these people over here. So um, don't gather berries right now. I just want you to loot the dead. And I don't think there's any boar out there, so let's even turn that off for now. So you go do do that. Once you're back, let me know, and we'll turn you back into a wood chopper over here. Um, where are you going? Out of curiosity, Kelly. You can't walk to your desired target. <clears throat> where, where's your desired target, Starcaster? So, like, what do you want to do right now? Mining, stone, pathing. Well, um, it's not here. I mean, we're mining down below, my friend. What what are you doing up here? Get out of here, you maniac. You don't belong over here. You we mine over here, okay? That is the um the, the oh, you know what it is? Usually my the engineer was over here grabbing wood because usually we had it over here, right? But since we had those scumbags come over here and burn our wood stockpile, we lost those, so I made them out here. But these are just for my wood choppers, not for my people inside. So you know what that means? We should probably create a, um a stockpile inside, which I have never done, I don't think. So let me go into um, options here. Storage is what we're looking for. Object storage. And we'll do, you know, just a, a quick wood one just for them to kind of uh, mess around with over here. So we'll do raw wood stockpile. I'm just going to be only for the uh, benefit of my people working inside. I don't want to go out all the way out there just to grab some wood, right? So um, we'll put it, I don't know, somewhere over here. Seems kind of close to the carpenter area and this and that, right? So we'll just place it over here for now. And we'll just upgrade that pretty soon. And then that'll be up and running at no time. So yeah, that was weird, alrighty. Hooey. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm rusty. I had absolutely no idea what was happening right now. I was kind of worried about it. Okay, so comments. I was reading comments and people left me some pretty good ones. One of them was, um, Falcon, if you're going to be mining over here, your miners are kind of taking a long time having to come up these stairs and dump stuff off anywhere. Why don't you just put a, um, a stockpile over here for ingots and another one for stones so I don't have to go what they're doing right now. You see this? Yeah, that's a waste of time. And I figured, you know what, that's a very good idea. Thank you for that. So, let me go into objects over here too, and what we're going to do is go into storage, and nope, not wood. 
We want this for... <clears throat> well, we want one for metal, right? So we're going to put an ingot stack down over here. This will probably... Wait, that's ingot. That's not ore. Is that ore? Metal storage provides... Does it even matter? Ingot stack? Minecart? Because the ingot stack, I, I imagine you could probably um, increase that over time, right? While the minecart, it's a one-shot type of deal. But the mi the ingot cart would free for the mine, right? Oh, you could upgrade it, actually. Okay, so you know what? Let's put one down over here, then. That has been um, taken care of now. So go into storage. We'll do... Masonry is what we're looking for? No. <laughs> I'm telling you, cut me a break here, okay? It's been a while. I need to get, like, an episode to get accustomed again. Minecart down over here. Alright, so you post up here, and then we'll also put down a masonry stockpile, just in case. And we're gonna upgrade that one for sure, so we'll do not metal anymore, but masonry stockpile. This will be basically so they don't have to come all the way up here to grab or jump rocks off. And you can just post up right here, my friend, if you don't mind. Okay, there he comes. Um, here comes R. Kelly to build this shit for us. Always on it. Thank you, R. Kelly. How are you doing with the blacksmithing, by the way? You're at level 15. Good for you. Good for you. Alrighty. So I know that we have a lot of stuff in queue, though. We have coin that he is working on. He's turning um, our gold ore and silver ore into corn, finally. So we have a little bit extra cash coming in. There's a few ingots that I have also queued up over here because we do need to create some of these. Um, well, I guess we already created the wood barrels that I wanted. And also, we had an issue going on with storage here, and I set these up before the episodes. The weapons are also still in the yellow, and so is armor. Interesting. So we might need a few storage stockpiles for the weapons themselves here. Fatal Extraction is, um, no, that's the Fox. Fox, what are you doing, man? Yeah, but you have nothing to build? I find it hard to believe, considering working on a roof right now. Yeah, yeah, you get to work. I know there's something to do for you, believe me. Alrighty, so armor and weapon. I just want to get this out of the way because the whole yellow thing kind of throws me off. I'm over here kind of like, oh, god damn it, I just want to get rid of it. It's bothering me, it's calling my attention. I can't ignore it. Armor. So we're going to do an armor chest as well. It requires some ingots as well, so that's fine. Um, I guess we'll put you over here along with the other ones, just because I... You're a chest, and there you go. So I guess I could just kind of place you... Uh, let's see what's good. What works out for me? Just place you over here for now. <clears throat> Alrighty, now... Armor chest is there, and we also need one more, we said, for the weapons, correct? So objects, weapons are going to be storage, and nope, not armor anymore, bud. One more for the weapons, there you go. Weapon rack. You, my friend, could just line up over here as well. Okay, so that should hopefully get rid of that yellow stuff and keeps bothering me. Good. Um, how are you doing over here, Fado? Are you almost done with the um, looting of the bodies? Hopefully you are, because I want you to get back to wood chopping, I guess. All right, oh, here's a roof coming on. Sweet. So our builders are definitely continuing to work on the roof. Let's go ahead and speed the game up a little bit as well. Put this into three times speed. So we get some pro um, progress going on here today. Fatal is done, though. Excellent. So Fatal, you were wood chopping, I believe. We have two, three people wood chopping. Mm, we really need three right now. We have 306 wood. And that's a lot of wood, let me tell you. Um, Fatal, what else can you do other than... <clears throat> which out for is you could do infantry, but uh, I guess we could have you train meanwhile. That wouldn't be the worst thing, I suppose. Although Silent Psycho might have a little bit of an issue with that. She'll be like, wait a minute, I was the top fighter here, now it's going to be suddenly fatal. Um, yeah, fatal. Let's have you... I feel kind of silly not having resources. I mean, yeah, let's have you go train a while. How about that? So you go over there and train. What you're going to be doing is, um, I like how even though I turned you into an infantry, it still shows that you're a, for a forager. Let's have you just go and combat using training dummies. Alrighty. Do you need me to equip you with weapons to do that? Probably. I would imagine. So let me just give you a sword here for now. And should I equip you now? I guess if you're training and something pops up, it's probably best for you to have equipment on. So let's go heavy chest and we will go shield and heavy helm. Just so that you're ready to go, just in case something pops up, I don't have to run around and have to uh, get you ready. Um, Fatal, go and train, though. The, 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 basically, what I'm saying is go train, in case you don't understand. Fatal, I need you to train over here with the dummies, my friend. That's what you're supposed to be doing. You don't want to do it, huh? Uh, let's see. Wait in hall while idle? Nope. Combat training using dummies. That's what I want you to do. So let's have you come over here. 
grab your equipment. Okay, and then go train. Go train. Come on, there you go. <laughs> Alrighty, so down over here, a merchant has arrived. Another merchant, huh? That's not the worst case scenario. Where's this guy coming from, though? He's got another thing coming. What, no, for real, though, where is he? There he is. Okay. Meaning we probably have to get Davion Evans ready for some trading over here as well. That's not the big deal. It's not a big deal at all. Oh, and over here we have this over here set up. So let's go ahead and upgrade the storage one time for the minecarts. And we have we need ingots for that, which um, I guess what's-his-face should be working on. And by what's-his-face, I do mean R. Kelly. And then we'll also upgrade this one over here. Good. Um, R. Kelly, you are working on coin right now, but after coin you will do the standard ingots, huh? That's fine. I could have you kind of um, finish the coins off first. Now we need Davion Evans, who should be probably over here hanging out with the um, animals as usual. That's his thing. That's his MO. It's a big animal type of guy. Alrighty, so you, my friend, are going to go into Trader. Can't see it. There it is. Let's come over here and hang out. Now, did we make extra weapons so we could sell off? And by extra weapons, I'm talking about the clubs, and we did. Excellent. Alrighty. The wheels are in motion. Things are happening. I'm liking it. The roof is coming along pretty nicely over here, too. We should be getting this done, hopefully by today, if not soon. But that's pretty good. I like it. I went with the whole brick um, roof as well. So, Davion, this merchant's over here tagging, taking a sweet time. Get in here, merchant. There you go. Alrighty. You have no use for timber at this time? Alrighty, well, we'll see about that. We have money, though, to bargain with, correct? We should. He's willing to buy 16 seedlings for 4 coin. We have 30 of them. These are used, actually, I was con I was actually considering planting this soon because people let me also know in the comments that they're in the, um, st the mine thing that we just did right now. They're saying, Falcon, if you plant those seedlings, they'll go trees around your, um... <clears throat> little settlement right now, and that'll kind of help you out. I'm sorry for my <laughs> little gashes in nature. I had one of those, like, you know, heat-up burritos before I recorded, and it's not really sitting too well, you know? It's not doing too good down there. I'm not farting or anything like that. I assure you, you would probably hear it through the recording, but I'm just kind of like, you know, a little, ugh, little heartburn type of thing happening here. Um, so, no, I'm going to decline that one. Four coin, nah. Wait, I'm not really desperate for coin that much, and I'm going to sell that off. I'd rather just plant those trees down. What else you got for me, my friend? Come on, make it make it soon. Make it snappy. What else do you got here? I got things to do. All right, he's willing to sell 263 flax fiber for 32 coin. Now that, I kind of like. Let's see, how much coin do we have right now? We have 100 coin. 266 flax fiber could be good. I believe we need this for some of our future things that we got to do. At least turning it into twine at the very least. Which we do have a queue for twine, but right now... I believe Silent Psych was doing the Carpenter stuff for me. By the way, I should probably switch her back to Taylor now. I'm going to do this one. 263 seems pretty ideal. Uh, let's see here. So we're going to sell two potato seeds for 40 coin. Now, that's a little bit a little bit more expensive, but I want to say, don't we already have potato seeds? We do. Absolutely not. Don't eat your seeds anymore. I only need the first one, then I'll multiply them from there. He's willing to sell 55 copper ore for 28 coin. I want to say that last time that I played... I bought a lot of copper ore from somebody, so I don't think I need this. Let's see here. Let me just double check, but I'm pretty sure that I did, and I was pretty happy about it. 173, yeah. Uh, no. My good man. I, I'm not interested in that. 98 cotton for 20 coin. Now, this could be a little bit more useful, but we already have 53, so no. Now, cotton is actually used to make the next level of beds that I know of. So, um, we do want to acquire some of that. Two seeds for 40. I believe we already have a cotton field. So, yeah, we have 19 seeds now. So, no. We've definitely multiplied. We Remember, we started with only, like, one or two? He's gone now. He's mad. Oh, you want to trade me anything? Then fuck you. Well, you know what? Fuck yourself, merchant. How about that? Dave? Go back to um, hurting the animals, my friend. And Kelly is idle. Why are you idle? Uh, are you out of, um... We don't have the materials to craft a training dummy, correct? So, what is it that you need? Aha, twine. So for that, we need Silent Psychopath to come back and stop being a carpenter. Which he did a pretty good job of, anyway. So Silent, um, let's see. There's nothing in queue for you. Not particularly. So, yeah, let's go back. You're level 20 carpenter. Good for you. Let's have you go into, um, Taylor and make me some twine. So that, um, Kelly could go back to making those dummies over there. You know, since this guy's training away over here, what we could do is um, rebuild once broken. So that'll kind of, in a sense, break it down. Although, obviously doing this, it will cost us the, the 
the items in the long run because if they break it down by training on it, you're not going to get the items they use to um, construct it back. But, um, you know, at least he's leveling up over here, right? What level are you at now, Fatal? Oh, he's doing pretty good. He's about to hit level 10 soon. Alrighty, good for you, my man. Alrighty, so, let's see. Builders, are you guys um, still having a good time with this um, roof over here? Yeah? I wanted to get the upper level done first because that's the one that kind of worries me the most. You are doing a little bit of extra traveling, aren't you? I guess it's not too bad. It could be worse, but... Are you only doing, like, one brick per? You are. Is that because that weighs a lot, or is that because you're... You're... No, your encumbrance is, um, you know, as high as I'm gonna put it. I mean, I'll put it at 16 if you want. Let's see here. Yeah, she grabs four bricks at a time, and within one... Four bricks makes one stone. So, yeah, that's gonna take a little bit of time for sure. That sucks a bit, but, you know, so be it. Where's your other builder friend, though? Is he sleeping? He must be sleeping, right? There's only one person working on this. I mean, Scabia's a baller and everything, but, I mean, come on. She also needs the help occasionally. The fox is, indeed, asleep. Alrighty. So, Silent Cycle, you're done with the tailoring already. Wow, that was actually pretty goddamn fast. So, let's take a look at our situation here in terms of, um, what we wanted to do. Let's see, Flax Fiber is I wanted to start making the next level of weapons, but I think we needed to get R. Kelly to level up a bit more. He's still working on the ingots, or is he asleep? He might be asleep, as a matter of fact, because those, those coins have not moved. So he just might be asleep. Let's see, R. Kelly. Yeah, he's asleep right now. So unfortunately, we're not having those ingots being made, which I kind of wanted to get made. And that coin, those extra coins aren't being made as well. So for now, I guess, let's just have you... Do you want to go train a little bit? I think I could get you off of um, work here for a while if you want to go train. I don't think that's the worst idea because um, enemies are getting a little bit more difficult now. So, you know what, Silent? Go take yourself a little training journey here. We have enough um, timber right now that you could kind of um, take a little bit of time off. So, yeah. Let's have you go and train. So, I'm not going to give you your equipment, though, because you are going to go back to work kind of soon. But for now, meanwhile, that man wakes up. I'm going to have you just train and just grab a sword. And go just swing the sword around, and then we'll hit you back up soon. Yeah, maintain inventory, so we'll get you just the sword. And go train meanwhile. Combat training using dummies, alright. So come on over here, grab your sword, and go train on some dummies over there with your friend. Fatal. Go go train, though. Did you grab it? I'm pretty sure you grabbed it. Go train. Come on. Come on, I'm just standing around idly. There you go. That's what I want to see. <laughs> and she's over there rebuilding the ones that they break. That's awesome. Now, remember, we didn't need a lot of twine for this, though, because each one of them requires four, if I'm right. She built the majority of them, so she's going to continue just building as long as they keep doing her thing there. Although she is standing around again. Kelly? What is it now, Kelly? What is it now, Kelly? Don't tell me you're out of um, resources already. I guess we need to make a lot more twine. Never mind, that... Training journey is going to actually be short for you, Silent, because we might need more twine? Is that what this is telling me? Come on. Or maybe she just can't build it yet because they're in the way. Let's see. I'll give it a little bit of time and see what Kelly does. I mean, she just might be idle right now because of the fact that they're in the way, so she can't rebuild it while they're in the way over here just knocking down these um, dummies. We'll see. We'll see. I should have her do something else meanwhile, but I'm too lazy for that. Scabia, are you really done building? I highly doubt that, considering, you know, we have a lot of, uh, of an open roof here. But it doesn't seem we have bricks for you to actually continue. Now, that's no good. But I think that's because Homeboy fell asleep, so he wasn't doing any stonemason work. Right now, we have Mark Solar as our stonemason. And I think I put a second person as well, because we need a lot of bricks right now. We also have Super Flame. Super Flame is over here. Making the um, tools for ours, and then you're over here doing bricks, and now you're coming over here to do bricks. Alrighty, so Scabia, don't you worry, we'll have some bricks for you pretty soon. Kelly is the one that worries me right now, because she's um, just idling by right now. Alrighty, Kelly, I'll give you a little bit more time, and then we'll have to probably set down some more dummies for you manually. What if I just moved you? Sometimes you guys get a little bit stuck, and that worries me. Weren't you guys knocking down these um, dummies a bit faster before? Oh, there she goes. She seems to be... There you go. So now they broke one, she's gonna come over here and I get you. I get you. There you go. Alrighty. So, everything's looking pretty good. Trees, how is this coming along? 
<laughs> I like how my underground people are still... I can still see their words. A merchant. Is that another merchant? Jesus Christ. How many merchants are we going to get over here? Uh, Dave. Um, there's another merchant over here, Dave. I'm sorry. They keep coming. What am I supposed to do? Tell them, tell them to fuck off? I could. But then they might shun me forever. So come over here to do some trading, I guess. Um, again, we have those clubs that I want to sell. That's the reason why I made them to begin with. So come on. Let's see. What do you got from your merchant, man? Uh, let's see. He's willing to buy a twine for one coin. N no. We need that twine for our dummies right now, my man. What else you got? He's willing to buy three stone tongs for one coin. Yeah. You know what? Those stone tongs are kind of easy to make, I think, are they? I hope so. We're going to buy 89 timber for three coin. Eh, no. We're actually using the timber to continue our building over here, so absolutely not. Three turnip seeds for 60 coin. This could be ideal. Do we have turnips, or we don't? Oh, wait, 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 we do, right? That's turnip over here, correct? This is turnip right here. That's growing, so no, that means that we don't need it. Are we done with needing seeds? We might just be. He's willing to sell one shear for 14 coin. Uh, no, I don't think we need that whatsoever, right? We have one in the stockpile, and we also have the iron one, which is the, uh, the better one that I made for Homeboy to actually acquire better stuff from our sharp shears. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. Did our sharp shear finally break? Excuse me? Did you break Dave? Why don't you tell me you fucking broke the sharp shear? Oh, come on, Dave. Don't do me dirty this way, dude. Well, either way, we don't need the regular one, so I'm gonna decline that one. It's in your inventory, right? Tell me. It is. It, it's totally in his inventory. I just saw it right now. Um, he's willing to sell 68 wool for 14 coin. How many do we have? 48? And decline. Willing to sell 12 animal hide for 48 coin. Now, this is good because that means leather. That one I am willing to accept. It's going to cost a little extra coin, definitely. But again, we're not really getting that much. He's out of leather. But don't worry. We could turn the animal hide into leather. So that's not a big deal. Alrighty. I'll catch you later, dog. You go back to being the old herder that you are. And we also have the fox telling me there's nothing for him to do. That's probably because of the brick situation. I think I guess we probably need a few more people working on stone masonry after all. These bricks are kind of taking a while to actually build. I feel kind of silly now making this roof out of brick because it's taking a bit longer than I really hoped for. But, you know, I'm in it now. I can't really stop and be like, you know, let's just turn it into something else. That's kind of silly at this point. I guess we could probably add another stonemason though, maybe, huh? Let's see here. Stonemason. We have two people working on it. Um, I could get Dave off of herding to work on stonemason because he's a 10. But I think I'd rather keep him herding for now. Oh, boy. You know what? Give me a hand with the stonemason right now, Dave. And what we're going to do is that um, I'll keep tabs on you and we'll turn you into a herder on... Well, once we start noticing this over here drop a little bit. So that's fine. Because right now, my friend, we are in desperate need of bricks, so I need basically all hands on deck when it comes to the bricks. Alrighty, and everybody's just working. Alrighty, cool. So let's go on episode here. Everything went pretty well. I don't think there's any creepy crawlies around that I'm aware of. I'll check that out at the start of the next episode. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Leave a thumbs up, leave a like. The support does me a lot. Again, I'm still doing renames, so if you haven't gotten renamed just yet, don't freak out. We are getting a lot of extra people because our colony is doing pretty good. Our house is coming on pretty nicely. And once the roof is built, I want to start mass producing more... I guess regular bricks, because I want to start expanding the wall outward and start doing our little situation, what I want to do. Basically, we'll have like a housing area somewhere over here. This will just wind up turning into a farming herding area, and then we'll have like maybe, maybe we could even turn something over here into like a, a stockpile room for a lot of different things. But yeah, I want to start bake, breaking it up down the line. But for now, this is pretty good. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I will catch you next time.